Okay, thank you very much. Okay, Ms. Wick. Okay. Oh, thank you very much and uh, for your invitation and uh, also thanks to Dr. Hoa from Huy University of Vietnam for, 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 for sharing me information for me to train this uh, uh, webinar. Uh, my name is Huang. Uh, I uh, head up plant protection department of uh, Faculty of uh, Agronomy at Nong Lop University in uh, Ho Chi Minh City, Vietnam. And uh, uh, my uh, senior uh, uh, friends uh, in uh, Vietnam also is uh, Dr. Uh, Professor Chen Đăng Hoa from University of Huế in Central Vietnam is also participant in here and also take part in this uh, research. I would like to share with you also about the, the invasion of uh, blackhead caterpillar into Vietnam in last uh, four or five years, uh, three years. Um, yeah, and also it's some uh, practice uh, biological control in Vietnam so far. And in my presentation, they are contained up uh, Introduction, uh, the invasion of uh, blackhead caterpillar into Vietnam and some biological control, uh, what we have applied so far, and also some suggestion for researching in the future. Yeah, blackhead caterpillar is the worst uh, learned that's uh, their images from uh, India to Sri Lanka and many uh, nearby uh, country close to Vietnam like by, uh, Thailand recently. And uh, from in uh, India, Sri Lanka, Myanmar, and Bangladesh, it was uh, reported that this damage is very serious a long time ago, more than uh, 40 years ago. But recently from Thailand, this damage very serious in uh, some Public station in uh, 2018, and uh, but uh, unfortunately, uh, in uh, July of 2020, it was found damages in Binh Che, Vietnam. Binh Che is one of province in uh, Mekong Delta of Vietnam, and over there is we let's say that uh, coconut not only very important uh, crops. In Benche province, because uh, that is also coconut is the icon of Benche province in Vietnam. Talk about the Benche, they talk about the coconut. That means coconut is very important to Benche province. More than 70,000 70, hectares was planted here. And for Benche province, coconut not only giving the food, but also an industry about the processing. Uh, not only for drinking water only, but also processing many, many, many products from the coconut and making a uh, coconut economy from in Benche Brumin. And the uh, blackhead caterpillar were damaged very seriously, not only in the canopy, in the leaf, but also for in young fruit, it's damaged almost all, especially is Focus more focus in in mature leaf and also young old leaf, and there are some uh, picture of different uh, state uh, development stage of uh, phase of uh, uh, blackhead caterpillar and age and uh, larvae. Larvae was a six uh, instar and pupa and also the adult male and female. I could share with you all here. Just found in uh, July of 2020, you can see it in here in Benche province, but rapidly spread into nearby uh, provinces in Mekong Delta, especially in 2021st and 2022nd. Uh, and it's heavily damaged in, in, in uh, Benche province and Chavi province. Because of these other plant, many, many coconuts, the first thing. And the second thing is that uh, during this period is uh, COVID hit into Vietnam. So uh, during this, it's very, very limited of controlling methodology, methods were applied. 
that's why it's increased very quick. And in fact, number 10, we can share this use some uh, affected uh, area by HEPTA. And in main chair, uh, in last update in uh, March of uh, 2024, the damages was around 300 uh, HEPTA heavily damaged there. Not only Mekong Delta, for this year, early of this year, and it's damaged also the coastal area in central Vietnam, especially in some provinces as Khánh Hoa province, 48 heavy, heavy, uh, heavily damages, being Ninh Thuận and Bình Thuận also. And nearby in this area is there are some other province which coconut is very important, crops such as Bình Định and Quảng Ngãi in uh, north, uh, in northern part of the coastal area. Though part is very dangerous. These are some uh, pictures of the machines uh, coconut in uh, Mekong Delta in Vietnam. During that, uh, we found and we, we are doing many, many uh, survey, uh, surveying and also collecting the, the uh, natural enemy. What, why we will focus in natural enemy? Because the coconut uh, habitat is very close by the, to human activity. In the coconut farm, uh, the family stays there, living there, and under the canopy of coconut, there are many, many activities such as the animal feeding, aquatic, uh, aquatic culture also there. So that's why very difficult and very dangerous when we apply the chemical. So that's why the from uh, from specialists, uh, as well as for, uh, specialists, we uh, advise us we're looking for some more uh, natural enemy. And during the periods, and we found eight parasitic web includes of uh, six pupa parasitoid and two uh, lava parasitoids. Besides with us, we also develop how and we work to predator is a chrysotet. Chrysotet chest is very um, familiar with us over there because uh, we also, before we control the coconut beetle, so we also rearing chrysotet uh, chest to control the coconut beetle over there. So farmer, very easy to develop this one. And they are very uh, important uh, natural enemy which we have uh, developed over there. And now the Nong Lâm University also uh, from our department, we were working with plant protection department of Bình Chai province and also with, with other colleges from Huế University and also uh, plant protection uh, department of, uh, in central of southern Vietnam and also PPRI, where is my uh, French uh, doctor here and also uh, uh, attendant with us today, uh, develops uh, some methodology for rearing the and releasing the natural enemy uh, in Mekong Delta, especially in the Chai province. And we developed uh, some uh, brachial media uh, and also uh, uh, purple virus, which are people uh, parasitoid and we rearing a lot. And I could have sharing you some picture what uh, we are developing and also rearing system in uh, Ben Chai Proving, what uh, we done so far. And we still keep doing that. And we try to release uh, to the farmer, uh, release in the farm and transfer the uh, parasitoid to the, with the farmer and also authority in the provinces. And in here, I would like to share you some uh, film the uh, film. Uh, sorry, that's it too short time, so I, I cannot make, make it uh, sub. Uh, but uh, you can see some activity in here.
Yes. And uh, now we are use um, perpivorous uh, for and uh, control, uh, rearing and control, controlling and release. We have beside with the uh, habitats, we are doing this one and we found us, uh, the development and establish the development is very well. But recently, uh, the blackhead caterpillar redeveloped again, especially now uh, in uh, some key area like uh, Binche province is uh, redamaging. And here we are doing some uh, researching about the bi biology life cycle of uh, uh, purple virus on the blackhead caterpillar. And we're doing the uh, rearing of them in here. And release, rearing and release uh, purpivorous. And recently, uh, we also, until uh, last year, we released around uh, 5,000 web per uh, thousand uh, coconut. And the effectively, just around uh, four months later, is uh, reduce uh, the, the, the damages until six, more than 60%. This is quite uh, very, very, um, let's say, very. Uh, positive uh, result so far. And in the future, we need uh, a lot of uh, support, a lot of uh, cooperation with you all uh, to more develop uh, about the controlling black hair caterpillar in Vietnam. And so some basic uh, research in control will carry out and achieve some uh, results. Uh, and uh, for coconut, because it's very high and also the, in the environment habitat and the habitat of coconut, uh, human tea activities was there. So natural enemies show great potential and uh, um, to controlling backhead caterpillar. And uh, in near future, we are continuing research on biology of uh, coconut and its nature enemy and also research to improve uh, natural enemy rearing by alternative host. As I see some of my uh, shortly uh, sharing of our research so far in uh, Vietnam. Thank you very much for your attendance. Also, comment and also question are welcome. Excellent. Thank you so much for that presentation. And it is actually a very serious piece that's causing a lot of damage. And I'm interested in perhaps your thoughts on why I, I realized that in COVID it was difficult to control it, so it spread maybe quite quickly, but why has it all of a sudden, do you think, become a problem in Vietnam? How do you think it got there and why do you think it has become more of a problem over the last five years? The question is as what. Why? Yeah, why? What do you think is the reason for why it has suddenly become an issue for Vietnam in the last? Yeah, that is very interesting uh, question. Uh, the thing is that before is we also uh, looking for what the reasons uh, for for why the the the, the black caterpillar is uh, infected into Vietnam, but it seems so. Uh, it seems us uh, in Vietnam. We bought some palm from the Cambodia, Thailand, and also plant you know, from the Malaysia for landscaping area. So what we are worried is that maybe some the imported palms were uh, brings also blackhead caterpillar caterpillar. Uh, several years ago, but during uh, those areas, as uh, in uh, 2020, um, it's uh, broken uh, to be uh, damaged in Vietnam. It's before, it's maybe some weather, but uh, just broken from the 2020. Excellent. I think, uh, may, I, may I ask some, uh, some more uh, answer about yes. this? Place. Before, uh, you know, I see uh, before 2020, and we had problem with the uh, protein part. So, uh, in that is the invasive species. 
uh, we very heavy uh, investment uh, in Vietnam, uh, how Vietnam before, and we only take care of uh, protein bar. So we don't care about the B, uh, the uh, BSC because protein bar and BSC uh, symptom is very similar. So uh, that's why. I I think this is uh, I I don't think this the um, uh, BSC is the infected in uh, invasive in Vietnam in two thousand twenty maybe before but you see not many not uh, heavy and also we don't take care about the, the, the species so that's why um, after we can control the protein bar uh, on uh, by in, uh, uh, import is uh, naturally from. Um, uh, uh, from Samoa and some 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 places, so uh, that is I mean is the protein bar uh, um, well controlled. So that's why when protein bar control is uh, increasing uh, number. Okay. So that's why uh, we think <laughs> we think that because we don't have any uh, information exactly information about why is the uh, PSC infected from Vietnam uh, from yeah. to Vietnam. So that is the problem. Okay. Excellent. Thank you so much for that.